Hi, today I'm going to talk about the Concrete Care Splitters. We carry two in our range and what they are commonly used for is splitting concrete or rock in confined spaces or where you need to do it in a silent demolition fashion. Silent demolition is referred to as minimal noise where the alternatives such as using jackhammers or larger machinery are not suitable or where vibrations and noise reduction are critical. The size of this splitter here requires you core a hole at a diameter of between 44 and 48 millimetres and around about 610 millimetres in depth. If you're coring in particular, try and core another 40 or 50 mil just in case the end of the core does not break off. And when rock drilling, ensure that you do blow out all the fragments so that you've got that full depth ability to put the splitter wedges in. The direction of the split can be controlled by the direction of the handle. However you want to split your rock or concrete, you want to line up this and that will give you the direction of the split. If you're doing a series of, or a long length of split and you want to do a series of holes, have them no more than 600 millimetres apart. You can, off this power pack here, which is electric, it can run two splitters simultaneously. If you needed just to use the one and split after drilling a series of holes, they're no more than 600 apart and just continue to put them in that series until you get your desired length of split. Okay, so now the hoses are connected up on the power pack and also on the splitter. The controls on the splitter have a F for forward an N for neutral and an R for reverse. So we want to ensure that the control is in the neutral position when we go to start the power pack. Starting the power pack, switch it on here. Now we're ready to split. For more information, contact your local Kennards Concrete Care. Our seven specialist branches are located across Australia and don't forget, we can deliver 24-7 Australia-wide. Mm -hmm.